Hello there. I've just arrived in New York City for a YouTube event. Flew in from Austin. Dan has flown in from London and also just arrived. And I, I don't think I've seen Dan in about, I want to say three months, maybe. And three months ago, Dan left the army. He's a civilian now. And specifically asked me to film my reaction to seeing him for the first time in three months. So I'm excited to see what he looks like now. <laughs> <laughs> what? What? Oh, my beard. Bloody hell. <laughs> what? Where oh. have you been? You've been in a cave. Right. <laughs> Look, alright. Don't, don't laugh it. Don't laugh it. Right, nobody told me, yeah, how to do a beard. I've never had a beard before. No one's gone, oh, you need to do this and shape it. So it just sort of looks like a big mess. Like there's bits coming out all over the place. Like, what is that? It's completely flattened. Your head down. You look like a, you look like a different person. Yeah, but completely different. Like, why is this out here? I don't see other people with bits of beard out here. What do they do to it? You gotta do is put like oil in it and that when it gets to that length, or trim it. No one told me this. Are you gonna keep it like that for videos? No, oh, I don't want to. Because like, I got on the plane. I, suddenly... I had a shower this morning. I got on the plane. and I was like, God, I look like an idiot. I look like a mangy idiot. You're on the way look to it. sort of like Brian Blessed almost. <laughs> look at it. Oh, no, I just want to get rid of these little tufty bits that don't, like, what is that? What is that? Come over to the light, bit. Look. That is absolutely... Turn around, let me, let me get this way, look. So you can see, like, all the bits hanging out of it. It's just that minging. must retain water when you get out of the shower. Yeah, I have to, like, shampoo it and condition it now. And I keep forgetting about drying it off so it just drips on me. You've only been out of the army for about two months. Hefty beard growth be. That is absolutely. Did you just literally like you walked out of the army and then never shaved again? Yeah, I haven't. I haven't actually looked in the mirror since then. Otherwise, I would have shaved by now. Yeah, I just thought, how big can I get it? And then I didn't realise that you had to actually like manicure it and do stuff to it. No one's ever told me this, so yeah, that's what happens. Not oh, not a bad day here in uh, Brooklyn. Bloody nice. Twenty three degrees today. Windy as out though. I couldn't even make it to the hotel. I was almost blown away. Got those uh, water cabs. See the Empire State over there. Do you think it'd be inappropriate to make a second channel video just around your beard? Is that is that too nothing of a subject to make a video around? I'm just thinking. Hold on. <laughs> can be done. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, if you sort if of can, pondered on it, I could get some sort of. St oh, bloody hell! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's long. How's that happen? You can twiddle it. Yeah. Wow. In my mind, you see, I don't really have a big beard. In my mind, I've still got, I'm not used to it yet. Well, you must have trimmed it out of the way of your mouth. Oh, the only thing I've done is like trimmed it out of the way of the mouth. Yeah, it's, otherwise it'd cover your lip. Otherwise it's like, Phew. Yeah. I can't like eat anything. Welcome to the bloody slow-mo guys with Gavin and some bloke who's never been in a video before. What is it? Dave Badil. David Badil? Yeah. <laughs> I, think, I don't think you're Jewish enough for uh, Well, do I not deal. look a bit Jewish? Uh, that's sort of, I suppose. Yeah. yeah. He looks after his beard. Yeah.